Well, first at six, an Anoka County family is devastated after one of their dogs was killed by a hunter's arrow. The family is asking authorities to take action, but they also want to prevent this kind of thing from happening again. Carla Holt talked with the family about what happened. Anna, can you give Lucy kisses? For the Fuller Anna. family, each person and pet plays her role. And we'd lay them next to each other just to compare her size because she was a small boxer. But Meaning that today they're feeling the loss of one. Just the heartbreak, you know, I, she was my baby. I called for him and then only Zeus came back. On Thursday so, evening, Scott Fuller first realized later, something was wrong when their 40 pound six year old boxer failed to come home. And I said, come on Zeus, show me where here is. And we walked back here and uh, he walked right to her. Scott discovered Hera dead, shot by an arrow. It looks like she had gotten up for one more try, got another two or three feet, and then she, that's where she died, yeah. Scott tracked to where Hera was first hit. And it was like, you could still see a stand. Like from here and later here. learned from a sheriff's deputy, a hunter admitted to shooting Hera after targeting a buck. And then after the buck ran, there, there pops up Hera, you know, and, uh, it sounds like he said at first he thought it might have been a, a coyote. He just shot her and I mean, he didn't even bother to go look to where. Today, the Fullers believe the hunter should face some kind of consequences. You see someone's dog, you don't just shoot it. And while investigators review the case, every member of this family. He's just missing her. Adjust to life without the boxer who came before the babies and the other boxer. The dog who allowed her humans free reign and her full heart. Zeus doesn't know um, life without her. An officer with the Minnesota DNR confirms people cannot shoot a dog even if the dog is chasing a deer at this time of year. But it is still not clear if charges will follow. Meantime, the Fullers just want hunters to beware so other families don't experience their heartbreak. Julie. Oh, man,